you feel like justice is done today with the verdict? Absolutely. What would you tell the jury? Thank you. How do you feel right now? Good. And, and the best part about Some this. smiles, but very few words from the Boston Teamsters who were found not guilty in the Top Chef extortion trial. It took the jury about 20 hours to reach a verdict. The Teamsters hugging each other and their families in court after learning that they were cleared of any wrongdoing. Our Christina Hager has been in the courtroom and she has the story. Oh my God, my, my heart's pumping out of my chest. Justice revealed. That's all that matters. Thank you guys. A legal victory for four Teamsters found not guilty of conspiring to extort jobs. But was it a moral victory? For weeks, prosecutors showed them at what may have been their worst, perhaps why one of the defendants said this, leaving court. No, I think the four of us were the big losers. Tires slashed. The star of reality TV cooking show Top Chef saying she was terrified. And this cell phone video. Scab yeah, like you. I, I certainly think that uh, these prosecutions will uh, make uh, organized labor a little more careful in some ways. The Teamsters' wrath was aimed at the production company that had come into Boston refusing to hire union drivers. Do you feel like justice is done today with the verdict? Absolutely. What would you tell the jury? Thank you. Top chef workers said they saw defendant John Fiddler lean into the show's host, Padma Lakshmi's vehicle saying he would bash her pretty little face in. The acting U.S. attorney expressed disappointment. The defendant's conduct was an affront to all the hardworking and law-abiding members of organized labor. I, I think that the jury saw this case for what it was in, 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 in the sense that the government had to prove a violation of the law and they didn't do it. This verdict could also be seen as a victory for Boston City Hall because there was testimony that an aide to the mayor had threatened to withhold permits if Teamsters weren't used. Today, the mayor denied that any permits were withheld and said he doesn't condone any strong-arm tactics. In Boston, Christina Hager, WBC News.